Hey, what's going on? I'm back with another tip. Uh, today I wanted to kind of just move away from technical and go a little more um, philosophical, if you will, I guess. There's a great quote that I was reminded of over the last few days uh, by a photographer named Henry Cartier-Bresson, and he is considered to be the father of photojournalism or street photography. And his quote, I'll, I'll read it to you here, is, to make photographs means to recognize simultaneously and within a fraction of a second both the fact itself and the rigorous organization of visually perceived forms that give it meaning. It is to put one's head, one's eye, and one's heart on the same axis. Pretty cool. Pretty good quote there, if you ask me. What I interpret that to mean is a photographer is constantly analyzing the situation in front of them. They're trying to think, what should I set the camera on to capture what I'm feeling or to show the emotion of the scene. They're trying to remove things from the background. They're trying to visually compose while not losing that emotion, while getting the camera settings right. And all of that is what I love to do. And I would hope that when you are taking photos, that, you know, you stop and you think about that kind of stuff and re or just realize that. Um, kind of a funny story a lot of times you're, you're shooting a wedding and the couple's doing their first dance and they are completely alone in a room of 200 people. And what I mean by that is they're on the dance floor and they're looking at each other and they're sharing this incredibly special, wonderful moment that they've waited for. And I go, I'm taking all these pictures of, of this bonding, wonderful time. And then all of a sudden you hear from the back, Anne Helen yell out, turn around he's trying to take your picture and it's like thank you aunt helen but the photo was the emotion of what they were feeling as they're doing their first dance it doesn't mean they have to turn and look at the camera so um you know just try to remember that when you're taking pictures that there's a lot more to it if you just go with the flow if you capture what you're feeling instead of just what you are seeing and learning the aspects of your camera whatever it might be whether it's an iPhone or um, you know a Nikon D7 or 6 whatever their, their latest one is you just have to know the equipment you have and just go with the feeling and, and capture it to the best ability you can so that's today's tip. A little philosophical, but, uh, you know, keep those things in mind. Thanks.